In this video, I will try to show how to find the time when the particle is not due north or south or east. It's in between north and east or north and south. So suppose the particle is uh, due northeast. It means the particle has moved. Uh, the distance between the particle, that is the line PQ, is in between north and east. In this case, the angle is always 45 degree. So if we draw a right angle triangle this is your 90 degree that angle will also be 45 so since this is an isosceles triangle these two sides will be equal so if we have the equation of pq the vector equation of pq that is something i something j format then the i coordinate here will be equal to the j coordinate since the distance is equal so if it's uh, northeast then the i coordinate equals the j coordinate similarly if the particle was um, due southeast suppose this one in that case the angle will be 45 45 similarly this i coordinate and j coordinate will be same but in this uh, case the y coordinate is in a negative direction so if it is if it's southeast then i coordinate will be negative j uh, if the point Q is in a uh, northwest direction, then we will have this kind of triangle 45, 45. Then these two sides are equal. So this is your I coordinate, that's your J. In this case, I is negative. That is, the uh, if the particle is due northwest. It will be minus i equals to j. Similarly, if the particle is in a southwest direction and we form any right angle triangle, this in this right angle triangle, the i and j will be equal. The magnitude of i and j will be equal, but the direction of i is negative, the direction of y, uh, j is negative, so minus i equals to minus j. That's for southwest. So suppose we have two point P and Q and um, R P R Q equals. So this is uh, the value for the final position vector for particle P and the final position vector of particle Q. If we need to find P Q, we, we need to deduct R P from R Q. This is uh, done in my previous video for uh, type two maths. So that's how you get the value of PQ here. So suppose if we need to find the value of T, if particle Q is northwest of particle P. So if uh, you can memorize the formula here for northwest or you can just draw a random north south east west so particle q is to northwest of p so the center will be p that's your northwest direction so this is your point q so if we draw any right angle triangle this is your i and this is your j so you can see that i coordinate is negative and the j coordinate is positive so here the i coordinate negative i will be equal to the positive j so the i and j has to be from the equation pq not rp or rq it has to be from the relative distance the displacement equation so the i coordinate is negative so minus equals j so minus 2 plus 2 so that's how um, 5t equals 1 so here t equals to 1 by 5 similarly you can find the value for the remaining direction just considering the sine of i and j so you do not need to memorize all this you can draw a rough diagram to find the direction